Good morning to all my exclusive coffee subscription drinkers. It is RF Mike, and today's a new day, and we have a new box that arrived in house last night, or yesterday, I should say, by the time you are watching this video. And we have obviously a new form in our box. They are going uh, vertical with the box now instead of perpendicular. So when you open it up, as we can see here, we'll open up our box, we have presented with our coffee right up front. And today we have the new Rambo coffee. Obviously this is coming off, off of a, a play on the actual Rambo movies and what Black Rifle thinks of Rambo as a movie or as a production. So if you want to check it out, go to their website and they have a story they made about it and some reactions they did on it. So, But this is Rambo coffee and our new black rifle decal as we can see here and as you guys can hear i have the uh, pots going in the background We're getting ready let's say we have a ford bronco old school ford bronco very nice uh serving serving premium coffee to people who love america on our back here a uh, different rambo graphic that's nice they poured the first cup <laughs> Very cool, let you know. Okay, so about our Rambo coffee here. Let's get to it. Our latest 86.5 score micro lot packs a lethal punch. Hailing from Kuxinalas Farm in Indonesia, region of Guatemala, this natural process roast comes fully loaded with explosive notes of chocolate, butterscotch, and honey. Paired with the bright acidity, honey normally that begs to be messed with for better or worse so origin is guatemala tasting notes are chocolate butterscotch and honey as i mentioned the aroma is a honey aroma full body acidity is brightness region is argentina like i said the farm is from cuxinalis and pacalama Paca, pacamara is a variety the processing method is natural Growth is 15 to 1800 miles above sea level and it's an 86.5 score. So let's go on ahead and check it out. What we have inside our bag, how the coffee looks. And then uh, we will straight up cut to the tasting. We're going to keep this one short. Oh, yeah. A very nice light roast. Smell actually, that smells very good, very, very good. Yeah, definitely a light roast, full body acidity. This will be, I like that we have two different pictures on this. That is cool, two different hand drawn designs, very nice. But anyway, let's go on ahead and see how this tastes. All right, so as you can see, today's method I have decided to do French press with it. So here's how it looks. All its lightness and probably some oils, as you should be able to make out. Everything just spinning, just got done with the stir. We're gonna go on and put the press on it and let it steep for its time, and then we will push everything down. All right, so our timer is done here, as we can see. So let's go and pull that off and let's see how this turns out both physically just how it looks and let's check out uh, how this tastes and obviously you all will not know how this tastes unless you have actually ordered a batch of this yes definitely a much lighter looking Roast, that's for sure. And then let's use the straw. As for our taste. Oh, very smooth. Yes, you can pick up some of that walnut. Can taste the uh, 
can definitely get a taste of that honey to it. That is actually really good. I might actually give my wife this plane today and not add anything to it. So that is it for this look at this month's special edition coffee. If you all like the video, hit the like button, comment, subscribe. This is Mike. Chat with y'all in the next one.